Good morning, PHS, and welcome to WPHS News on National Cheese Toast Day. I'm Allison. And I'm Nastasia with a look at today's news. Nominations for homecoming court should be turned in to Mr. Stevens by email. If you wish to be nominated for homecoming court, you may also sign up with your third period teacher. Signups are preferred. Nominations are due tomorrow. The Big Red Band competed in the John Marshall High School Band Showcase Saturday. They placed first in their class for percussion and second in their class for musicality and drum major. They placed second for percussion overall out of all bands competing. There is a trip to Japan planned for next summer. Please stop by room 226C for information. Flyers are on the door. 2023 yearbooks are now on sale. They are available for the early bird price of $55. After October 9th, the price goes up to $60. To purchase, visit yearbookordercenter.com. Yearbooks will be delivered in the spring. Any student in need of help in math or science, senior Rohan Malik Hamarani is offering tutor in the library during seventh period lunch every day. Attention current members of National English Honor Society. NEHS will be reviewing applications today after school. Please be there to help choose new members. They will also be discussing meeting times for the year. Attention seniors, junior cabinet wants your opinion to help make prom the best it can be. There are two possible dates for prom. Seniors are now able to vote on the prom date they want during advisory by scanning a QR code. Voting will be open through Monday for seniors only. Votes will be counted on Monday after school. The Big Red Bakery will be selling banana bread and pumpkin bread this week for a dollar. Orders will be accepted before or after school in room 222 South, cash payment only. Orders placed by next Tuesday after school will be delivered during advisory on Wednesday. Mrs. Liotti's Human Services class will be hosting a girls' thrifted clothing, shoe, and jewelry pop-up shop to raise funds for the So Love Boutique. It will take place through September 23rd in room 218 South before and after school and between classes. Come check out some great deals and get some early Christmas gift ideas. Here's Thea with a look at today's weather and Katie with a random fact of the day. Here comes the sun. Here comes the sun. Today's weather is mostly sunny with a high of 80 and a low of 54. Did you know that the world record for eating grilled cheese sandwiches is 47 sandwiches in 10 minutes? I'm Lakin with a look at what's happening in sports. The girls soccer team tied George Washington on Tuesday 1-1. They play South tonight at home beginning at 7.30. The boys soccer team lost to South Tuesday 1-0. They play South Charleston tonight at home beginning at 5.30. The football team plays South away tomorrow beginning at 7.30. Tickets are not available at PHS. They are available online on the South website or at the gate. The cross country team competes at South before the football game tomorrow. Here's Erica with today's lunch. Today is breakfast for lunch with French toast sticks. The girl special is a barbecue rib sandwich. Today we're here with some of the girls soccer players. Margaret Mildren, Peyton Loudon, Claire Tatterson. So you guys play South tonight. How have you guys been preparing for this? Um, we've been preparing by picking each other up in practice and working as hard as we possibly can in practice. All right, well, good luck. So, Mr. Lynn the Mood, what are you looking forward the most to during Rivalry Week? Rivalry Week? Oh, we gotta take South. Well, you gotta beat South. I'm telling you, brother, it's all about getting them and getting them good. You understand me. Upon the passing of one of our fellow students, Caleb Van Camp, on behalf of the senior class, we'd like to express our condolences. A class of 2023 blanket has been donated to the family. And this Friday, we'll be having a hat day. And uh, please bring a donation of at least a dollar or higher. And all the proceeds will be going to the Humane Society as the family wished. And we'd like to express our condolences again uh, to his family and to his friends. And we're all mourning his passing. Thank you for watching WPHS News. Join us next time for the latest PHS update.